Hey, people, how are you? Edward Wright here, and we're going to get in a quick session. Have you been enjoying our videos in G-flat? I hope so. Um, I've been, I think I had a few songs I had to learn that was in that key, and I just kind of stayed there for a minute and really um, just played in it. I said, you know what? I think that would be good for us to do, right? So uh, we've been doing the one, five, four, uh, the three, four, six, you know, just doing different, you know, progressions that hopefully that you can um, already apply them to your playing and all that good stuff. So let's even dive more into that. All right. All right. Let's go. So uh, this one, let's kind of play a little bit and see. So let's start there, all right? All right? So let's start with our left hand. We have the one and flat seven. Literally, that's how you're doing from that going from the flat seven to the five. And remember, the flat seven of G flat is what? E. A whole step below the one. That's the flat seven or F flat, okay? So flat seven, six, sharp five, five, or uh, that minor six, the flat six, all right? So flat seven, minor seven, six, minor six, five. So let's do that three times. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. Two, three, and play. Uh-huh. One more time and let's do it. Flat seven, six, minus six, five. All right, you got it. You know, just kind of... You know, just work out a little bit, all right? So let's draw right hand. So our pinky is gonna our pinky is gonna remain on that one. So we have five, four, flat three, three of F of F of, of G flat. Okay? So we have five, four, minor third, three. Do it again. Let's go. Five, four. Again and go it. Uh, hey, you got it. Do it again and play now. Yes. All right. This time, hold that pinky down with that one. Let's do it every time. Five. Yep. 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 You got it. You got it. Do it again and five, four, flat three to the three. All right. Put both hands on it. Let's go and hey. Hey, hey, you got it, do it again and play now, yeah, that's it, you got it, do it again, play now, and, yep, 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 come on, three more times, let's go, and now, yeah, two more times, let's go, we're going to that flat seven, chromatically walking down our left hand, you got it, and then the five, <laughs> four, flat three, three. In our right hand, one more time, let's go. And yep, yep, yep. Hey, you got it. All right, I love it. What is the five of G flat? Awesome. Um, the five is D flat. Uh, G flat, A flat, B flat, C flat, D flat. Uh, D flat is five of G flat. Let's make sure that's right. So you can see it. One, host up two, host up three, half step four, host up five, D flat. What is the sharp 11 of G flat? What is the sharp 11 of G flat? What is the sharp 11 of G flat? Ooh. 
That's right. It's C. Very good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. You sharp it. C natural. C. Okay. And where will we use that? That G flat sharp eleven. Right? So let's talk about that. And our left hand. And again, this is not the way to voice it. It is a way, right? Remember, there's multiple ways of doing it. Uh, this is just a way. Let me show we say that, all right? So we have uh, the one, five, and nine of G flat, okay? One, five, nine, okay? Then our right hand, we have the sharp 11, the 13 or the six, the nine, and then the sharp 11. Okay. See that? Or an A flat chord <laughs> over G flat. <laughs> or a D flat major nine. Let's take like a D flat major nine because we have the D flat there. <laughs> the seven, nine, five, and seven. And they have that voice like that over G flat. See? Now, again, I like to name all my chords from the bass note because if we're looking at a chord chart, right, everybody can read it. That's bass, that's guitar, that's horn players instead of having all these slash chords, okay? So that's my reasoning for naming or for wanting to name uh, chords from the bass note, okay? Just something that for you to know about me, all right? Let's, but let's get back into that chord to make sure you have it. Okay, got it? And so you can do that, and then if you, if you want to come up and do that thick voicing. Now, I have my right hand still doing the same thing. My left hand I have G flat, A flat, B flat, and I'm actually still hitting the C too. So I'm hitting the C with my index finger of my left hand and my thumb. Okay, again, play. F whatever's comfortable for you, play okay again this is not the way this is a way all right so we have uh what is it oh no that's what we did i just did the whole step up you see that a flat uh sharp 11 to the g flat sharp 11 to the e sharp 11 to the d sharp 11 to the c sharp 11 Make it an exercise, man. So what did I just do? I moved up whole, whole, moved up whole steps, okay? So we're still working out in G flat, having fun. All right, G flat, E, D, C, B, B flat, excuse me, A flat, G flat. All right? <laughs> That's fun. Have some fun oh my gosh ladies and gentlemen all right hey again we're spending time in g flat spend some time man get in dig in be amazing all right thank you so much for sharing with me if you've enjoyed this session make sure that you like uh the video make sure you subscribe to the channel comment support the channel your cash app your zelle is is greatly appreciated all right, and I'll see you later. Peace.